Hosting Western Boone earlier today on the Chargers' home field. We'll pick up the action early in the first quarter. Western Boone fumbles the handoff but would recover, and that would be a big play because on the very next play, C.J. McMahon finds Austin Burtner across the middle, and Burtner is in for six. The Stars would then go for two, and after McMahon rolls right, he finds Riggs Baxter in the back of the end zone. Eight, nothing, Western Boone. But back comes North Montgomery. Jalen West hands the ball off to Joel Koth, and Koth gets loose for the big gain. He gets inside the Stars' 20-yard line. North Montgomery is in business. A few plays later, check out the throw and catch. West puts it where only Koth can catch it. Trent Johnson and Dave Mecklenburg rule it a catch and a touchdown. Chargers cut the lead to 8-7. to seven. How about a Martins moment nominee? North Montgomery forced a punt, and Dakota Ramey shows off his athleticism. Check out the big fella. Punts it all the way down inside the Western Boone 20-yard line. The Stars would have to go 80 yards if they wanted to put points on the board. And that's what they did with four-tenths of a second on the clock. Western Boone runs the draw, and L.V. Bowden is gone. And that touchdown would be the difference in this one. Western Boone hangs on for the 14-13 victory over North Montgomery. A few scores to pass along from today. Harrison and Lafayette Jeff were both playing afternoon games on the road in the HCC. Harrison falls to Zionsville 55 to 14. Meanwhile, Lafayette Jeff loses at Brownsburg by a final score of 42 to 6. At Carroll, the Cougars defeat the Gophers of Clinton Prairie 42 to 8 is the final there. Lebanon gets a win at home tonight against Southmont 34 to 20 is the final there. North Vermilion also wins at home tonight over Attica in a close one 28-20 is the final. The Sheridan Blackhawks also get a win tonight by a final score of 25 to 8. Try Central way too much for the Clinton Central Bulldogs, 55 to 12 is the final there. And in Crawfordsville, the Athenians fall to Tri West by a final score of 37 to 14. Switching gears to volleyball, the Central Catholic Knights took part in the Blue River Valley 1A showdown earlier today in Muncie. They knocked off Spring Valley in their first match before falling to fifth-ranked West Dell in two games. The Knights then bounced back in their third match and defeated Blue River Valley in two games. And in their final match of the day, number one-ranked Cowan knocked off CC 21-25, 25-12, and 15-5. And last but certainly not least, in girls' soccer, Lafayette Jeff defeats Highland 1-0. And in the Hoosier Conference championship game, the West Lafayette Red Devils win by a final score of 8-0. Congratulations to the West Lafayette Red Devils. And it's time to hit the links at the Battleground Golf Club. A great look at the par 3 fourth hole. We start with Lafayette Jeff's number one, Samantha Hatter. She was playing par golf all day. She gets the par right there. And then sticking with the par 3 fourth hole, Harrison's Emily Llewellyn, who was putting to save par from the fringe. She comes up just a bit short. Llewellyn trying to find her groove. She finished with a 92 on the day. We move ahead to the par 3 seventh hole. Lafayette Jeff's Abby Carlson dealing with a decent lie in the sand. Check out that shot, which puts her in great shape to save her par. Carlson finished with a 93 today. And for the Broncos, every shot counted down the stretch. And last but not least, CC's was also taking part as a team. Christine Minter just misses her putt as well. She shot a 90 today for the Knights. And as for the team results, check this out. Lafayette Jeff wins the regional on a tiebreaker over Valparaiso. The Broncos had to use their fifth score to decide the regional champion. Chesterton rounds out the top three. Lafayette Central Catholic finishes seventh. Twin Lakes finishes ninth. The Rensselaer Bombers just missed the top ten in 11th, while the West Lafayette Red Devils finish in 15th place. Individuals advancing without a team include Western's Allison Lindley, who shot an 80, and Lafayette Central Catholic's Morgan Brown, who finished in a tie for third with an 80.